Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as many of you know, last week Microsoft rolled out their Patch Tuesday updates, which are rolled out on the second Tuesday of every month for both Windows 10 and 11 and are compulsory mandatory automatic updates. Now, with the rollout and release of last week's Patch Tuesday updates, there's been a bit of confusion online and in um, the media, and there have been some reports that have made their way online that Microsoft is going to replace their Patch Tuesday updates with a new auto patch service. And um, the auto patch service, uh, in case you don't know, uh, is basically um, a service that Microsoft announced back in April of this year. And it's an automatic update service for both Windows 10 and 11 enterprise customers. So it's a paid service. And in a nutshell, it's designed to basically make it easier for system admins and administrators to manage and roll out updates for Windows and Microsoft 365 apps. So it's a service that will run in the background and just make it a lot easier and auto-update machines without um, administrators having to go check the machines and double-check that machines are up to date. So uh, it's just an automatic service that's designed to make it easier for the Patch Tuesday updates uh, in to roll out to enterprise customers. Now, where the confusion came that Microsoft was going to um, uh, discontinue Patch Tuesday was that in that announcement, Microsoft said that they were aiming to make Patch Tuesday just another Tuesday for enterprises. And that statement, I quoted just another Tuesday, caused a lot of uh, confusion, as mentioned, in the media. And there's been a lot of reports, which are false, by the way, because Patch Tuesday is going nowhere. Um, a lot of false reports that um, Microsoft is discontinuing um, the Patch Tuesday updates that rolled out on the second Tuesday of every month. Um, because Microsoft, as mentioned, announced that they were releasing the new auto patch service and that's rolling out next month in July. So that led a lot of media outlets to believe that last week, the 14th of June, was the uh, last Tuesday um, that uh, the Patch Tuesday updates, updates would roll out. Thereby, many thought that this would be the end of Patch Tuesday, basically, as we know it. So as I mentioned, these are false rumors. And Microsoft has even confirmed due to all the false reports and confusion in the media. And they have mentioned in a recent announcement, which I'm just going to quote. And they say, quote, monthly security and quality updates for supported versions of the Windows and Windows Server operating systems will continue to be delivered on the second Tuesday of the month, commonly referred to as Patch Tuesday or Update Tuesdays, as they have been to date. So that will clear up any confusion that if uh, you were concerned that you weren't going to be getting your Patch Tuesday updates anymore and would have to subscribe to an auto patch service, that's false. And that only applies to enterprises who want to pay for that subscription service called auto patch. Otherwise, um, the Patch Tuesday updates will roll out normally. And next month in July, we are expecting the Patch Tuesday updates to roll out as normal on the 12th of July next month 2022 which will be the second Tuesday of the month. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.